Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Did my lipstick on my date? Sorry if like my lipstick is all over or my makeup looks super janky. I actually just got back from dinner and I wanted to film this really quickly because from the title of this video, you guys can see that this month's boxy charm is so far a fail. Yes, an, a fail. It's a fail. It's a fail. Um, before we get into that, if you guys are new here and you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe to my channel. Hi, my name is Jennifer. Let's be friends. Um, make sure you give this video a like, maybe comments. Let's, you know, let's get to know each other a little bit. Um, and yeah, so let's, let's jump right in. Let's get into it. Let's, let's get a little spicy today. Let's, let's talk about it. <sighs> Guys, <sighs> I'm so annoyed. This looks like it was going to be such a good box, such a good box. I don't, I don't understand what happened. I don't understand what happened. <sighs> okay, so before, before I get into it, before I get into it, let me just say that I do appreciate Boxy Charms customer service. Their customer service is by email only, which I find, I find a little annoying I don't like when companies as large as boxycharm only have customer service by email I think that they should have the capability to um, have customer service by phone as well but for whatever reason they choose to only have customer service by email so fine whatever um, I did reach out to them via email and explain the situation I did get an automatic response, which was um, to say, you know, sorry that this happened um, and someone will get back to you within, I think they said 48 hours. I did do a little bit of digging on their, I think it was on their actual website um, that said if you do like incur this problem, that typically if you at least alert them within 14 days of your actual delivery that you should be able to get a replacement box sent out to you I think now I haven't actually got a um, like an actual response back through email only the automated one so I don't know for sure if I'm gonna get a replacement box I'm really hoping I do because like I said, this box looks like it's going to be so good from what I can tell from the shambles that it's in, which you guys will see. I'll insert a clip um, of what's left of it, but it actually looked like it was going to be pretty bomb. This is what it looks like right now. But yeah, so basically what happened is it was delivered like this to my door and that was pretty much it. No explanation as to why. I'll go ahead and insert the clip here of what it looks like so you guys can see. Okay guys, so as you can see, this is how it was delivered to me. Like, I'm not even sure. I guess this was inside the box at one point. Yeah, I'm pretty sure this is what's inside the box. Uh, keeping everything from breaking, which as you can see, it was not successful. This stuff, on it I'm pretty sure was this substance which is something called glassy skin balm which feels kind of sharp so I'm not going to keep touching it um, 
And I'm really sad because there was something by uh, Artist Couture in here. And I'm so sad. This is the actual box itself. Like, what in the world happened? Like, how? How does this... What? What went on? I don't even understand what took place. The lip liners were just like the box was completely busted. There were three lip liners in the box at one time. This one completely, where is it? This one completely got smashed. Focus camera. The powder is all over it. Like the powder is all over my hands at this point. And this palette is. I'm scared to even touch it because it's like the little plastic chips get all over my fingers. But like the eyeshadow colors are actually really beautiful. So I'm super sad about it but like I said I'm still hoping that <laughs> they're so pretty mm, so sad oh do you guys see that color my pinky oh my gosh it looks so beautiful <sighs> yeah so that's pretty much it I don't really know what happened I've gotten two boxes before this I am fairly new to BoxyCharm I've only that's Leonidas, by the way, in case you guys don't know, he's here with me every single time. I go. And they arrived in really good shape, perfectly fine. Nothing was messed up in the box. Nothing was broken, messed up, nothing at all. Nothing looked like it had been used. Like I see a lot of things on YouTube sometimes where the, you know, title or whatever in the YouTube video is like, Something in my boxy charm box was used, or you know, sponge was used, or palette was used, or whatever. I've never experienced anything like that. I, I really think that Boxy Charm is a great company. I am not making this video to, you know, number one, say that Boxy Charm is a bad company. Two, get on anyone's bad side or ruffle anyone's feathers. I'm not doing this to, you know, shame a company or anything like that. I will continue to um, stay subscribed to BoxyCharm. I love my past two boxes. I love this box. I am hoping that, you know, I get an email, um, hopefully by Monday, that, you know, I'm gonna get a replacement box. Hey guys, this is future Jennifer coming to you from the future. I don't really know if that makes sense. But anyway, I wanted to pop on here really quick to say that it's now the next day. So it is Saturday and I'm getting ready to edit and uh, try to get this video uploaded. But I was going through my email and uh -huh, there was a response from BoxyCharm saying that they are going to get out a replacement box for the June boxy charm which is awesome I was so excited to hear that yay for boxy charm which I figured anyway I mean I really do have um a lot of faith in companies like that I think that they're like I said when I was filming the um video yesterday that I really was expecting the outcome to be just fine. The only thing that was a little strange was the time frame that they gave it. They said that the replacement box would be shipped out anywhere between 5 to 15 days. That's like such a broad time frame. Like could we narrow that down just a little bit, Boxy Charm? Just to talk about all that? Like maybe five to seven days? 
five to eight days. But yeah, five to 15 days was like, but I mean, whatever, it's fine. I'm just being a brat. So five to 15 days, I guess we'll have to do. Hopefully it's closer to the five days, but at least they're, you know, being a stand-up company and doing the right thing and sending out a replacement box, not giving me any hard times about it. Very first email that they sent out was, you know, hey, we're gonna get you out another box and no complaints here on my end. So I am very satisfied with their customer service. So I just wanted to pop on really quickly and say that. And now I will let you guys get back to wherever this video was at. Bye. I think it's an amazing subscription. I think you get a great amount of products, good quality, good brands for the amount that you pay. I just really wish that um, this wouldn't have happened. I, I honestly don't don't know what what took place. I, I don't know if it if it left the warehouse like this. I don't know if this was something that took place at the post office. I mean, if it did, I, I can't see how this would have been deemed acceptable to be delivered. I, I don't, I don't get this. Like, I don't know how this is acceptable by anyone's standards. I, I don't know, that's just weird. Um, I just wanted to make this video to share my experience. Um, and that's pretty much it. Like I said, this is not, to, to be, you know, like vindictive or, or, you know, like hateful towards any company. I'm not that type of person. Like I said, I respect this company. I like them a lot. I'm going to stay subscribed. I'm going to continue to pay for this product. I love BoxyCharm. I'm so happy with them. I've been subscribed. Hey, cool it, dude. Thank you. I've been subscribed to other things that are comparable to BoxyCharm and I've actually ended um, my subscription with them just because I wasn't happy with the, the quality or the brands of products that were being sent out. So I actually decided to unsubscribe, but I see myself staying subscribed to BoxyCharm um, for the foreseeable future. So I just want to be completely clear. This is in no way like a you know, I'm out to get boxy charm type of video. Not at all. Um, this is just a, I wanted to, you know, share my experience with my subscribers type of video. So yeah, that's pretty much it. Um, I don't, I don't understand what he's doing half of the time. Like he just makes the weirdest. Do you want to share with the class? Like what you're doing? You're weird. Anyway, I um, I think it's time that I go put my dog to bed. Um, probably myself to bed too before this video gets any longer or more strange. So thank you all for tuning in so much. I really do appreciate it. Uh, and I really hope that you guys know how much your support means to me. Um, it really, I mean, I would basically just be talking to myself if it wasn't for you guys. So it means the world to me that you guys tune in. Um, every single comment means the world to me. Every single thumbs up means the world to me. And every single person that watch, you know, watches my video means the world to me. I love you guys so much. Each and every one of you are beautiful inside and out. And I love you. Thank you so much. Have an amazing night. Bye. I had a uh, little pina colada at dinner, so. Mm. Anyway, um, I completely forgot what I was saying. He, he, what? What am I saying? Um. 
little hyper right now. <laughs> oh my god, this is so embarrassing. Um, 